CBS News 8's Richard Allen is live in our news and About medical marijuana helping AIDS and cancer patients. A British drugs company is trialing a new cancer drug. All right, so let's just do it again and come at it from a different angle. What is proprietary about your product or technology? You can call the According phone to her parents. It was amazing. It was like a miracle. <laughs> Opiate addiction is becoming a deadly epidemic here in the U.S. Cannabis oil made right here in San Diego. This home video gives them hope. My name is Robert Brook. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Vitality Biopharma. We're a drug development company focused on using cannabinoid pharmaceuticals to treat serious neurological and inflammatory conditions. Inflammatory bowel disease is a condition that affects about 1.4 million Americans. Most of those patients are just kids. There's very high unmet clinical need for therapies today. About 50% of patients just don't respond to frontline therapies. Cannabinoids are a very promising treatment for IBD. In large clinical trials, they've been shown to provide symptomatic relief in up to 85% of patients. In clinical trials, they've also been shown to induce remission in Crohn's disease patients. What makes our, our cannabisides platform so unique is that it enables site-specific delivery. We can deliver high concentrations of cannabinoids directly to the colon and avoid entry into the bloodstream. So we can uh, enable the relief of pain and inflammation without any systemic delivery of THC and any of the associated psychoactivity. It's real easy to be motivated when you get emails from patients and their families who have kids that can't eat, they can't gain weight, they can't go to school. Now we have the opportunity to provide a very potent and effective treatment for these people. We have a team that we've assembled that's very dedicated to that mission. And to me, I believe it's only a matter of time. And some would say a radical option. Marijuana for a five-year-old. But it was an option they hoped would change her life forever.